In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Google Docs to embed content into your Moodle shell. I'm going to start out by clicking the portal link from uh, the midmich.edu website. I'm going to go ahead and click log in and log into the portal. Once I get to the portal, I'm going to get uh, links to my Midweb, my email, Midweb, Moodle, uh, Google Documents. Um, if you've already switched to the new Midmail powered by Google, you'll have uh, access to uh, Google Docs. So I click on uh, Google Docs, and I have a PowerPoint that I want to uh, share with my students through my Moodle uh, site. So I'm going to upload this PowerPoint file into Google Docs by clicking Upload. Uh, I'm going to click on this Chapter 6 PowerPoint and hit select and I'm going to click start upload. While this is uploading I'm going to switch back over to the portal and I'm going to open up my Moodle site, Moodle site and log into my course. Um, I'll go ahead and go into the course where I want to display um, this uh, presentation file. It's uh, Right now Google Docs is converting it from uh, a PowerPoint presentation to a Google Docs format. I'm going to hit refresh. Okay, and here's the uh, presentation file. Uh, so I'm going to click on it to view it. And what I want to do is I want to share it. So if I click share, I will get this drop down menu. And at the bottom, we'll see the publish and embed link. And I'll go ahead and click that. And Google says, okay, to publish this, I need to uh, click publish document and then Google gives me an option um, to get some embed code so if I look here in this box Google has set up uh, the HTML code that I need to display um, the presentation inside my Moodle shell I can change the size this is the small size I could pick something uh, in the medium and large range but small is fine uh, so I'll click in here I will copy the code I'm going to go into my course shell I will turn the editing on. I'm going to scroll down. I'm going to put this at the bottom. So I need to add a resource. I'm just composing a web page because Google gave me the, uh, the document or the uh, embed code. Um, I'm going to just call this uh, Chapter 6 PowerPoint. And I scroll down to the Compose a Web Page section and toggle into the HTML mode and then paste the Google Docs embed code. Um, I can go ahead and hit save and return to course. So now when my students come in, um, what they'll end up doing is they'll scroll down, they'll find the chapter 6 PowerPoint link that I created, and it will just take them to another Moodle page. And inside the page is going to be embedded the PowerPoint presentation where they can scroll through uh, which is really nice because the student doesn't have to have PowerPoint installed. They don't have to download the presentation, but they have it. They can go through it and they can look at it. Um, the other nice thing uh, that you can do with Google Docs is you can actually uh, embed your Google document inside of the web page. I've done that in this course with my syllabus and my schedule. So if I click on syllabus, you'll see that my uh, syllabus actually pops right up here inside a, a Moodle course frame and inside a Google Docs sub window. Um, my students here have the opportunity they can print this, they can download the file um, and the upside for me as the instructor is if I've made a mistake in my uh, syllabus here all I have to do is go back to Google Docs open up the syllabus here uh, and make the change. Uh, no more uploading a new file, deleting the old file, uh, you know, hoping I uploaded the correct one and not the, the one that was still incorrect. Uh, this gives you a more fluid and dynamic uh, link into your course show. If you want more information on how to uh, link uh, your syllabus from Google Docs into your Moodle shell, uh, please get a hold of me and I can show you how to do that.